Hello everybody, this is going to be just one of those uh, quick videos during the week type thing. Um, so I've got this this asset package from the Unity 3D Asset Store. It's a sample project, a vehicle tool sample project. And so this is just the unedited uh, sample project, so I haven't done anything here. You can just look at uh, the train and stuff, and I'll, I'll go through this once uh, just so I can show you what it looks like and what I've done is taken this project and edited a bunch uh, to kind of turn it into the way I'd want it it's nowhere near finished and there's some problems with this sample project that we had to fix like you can see here it spins out way too easily and we needed to add some uh, script onto it or edit the script to make it um, work better and so the controls are kind of weird for the sample project I mean it works pretty well but it obviously um, spins out too easily and the center of mass isn't uh, low so we had to move the center of mass down so this is just what the default project looks like I'm just going through it one time real quick just to show you how this works so that's this map and what I've done is just taken this map and just kind of mess with it so you can open this project up here and then this so here, here's also what the code looks like uh, unity makes it really easy to manipulate things and things like that um, using C sharp or you could also use JavaScript but C sharp is a lot better in my opinion and so a lot of this was already here and what all we really added for the wheel wheel drive script uh, to kind of fix up some of the gravity issues and stuff was add some method here it basically makes it so it doesn't roll over as easily and things like that after you fix the center mass and there's a lot of stuff so here's the project after I've edited it some I lifted up the the track um, I moved like a ramp here and made it larger um, I've added water added trees and also the wind effect on the trees whenever you're actually playing it I want to give you a better look at this and actually building it um, so that it will render better than just pressing the play button and so me and my friend are kind of just wanting to build a racing type game and so we decided to use unity and that's what we're gonna do we're just gonna tr you know right now we're just messing with the physics and everything and sample project I'm basically completely new to unity and I've just been learning it um, for a while uh, a little bit of time now only like eight days actually but um, so here I'm going to play this project you can see it shows the little made with unity thing and then the car drops out of the sky <laughs> from an extremely high height and here's some test objects I put in here. There's like a little monkey head right there. I also added in sound for the driving. Um, I don't know if you can hear on the speakers here, but um, yeah, here I got off the track. I lifted the track up so you can fall down here. The water you can go in. And for some reason there's a tree growing under this water. Normal looking tree. And uh, let me press the R button, and that respawns you to the nearest uh, spawn point. Oh man, how did I just do that? Anyways, so... In the bridge here, I added a little light. You can see the road textures are definitely different. Um, the terrain is manipulated. Added, added some weird textures like like on that wall 
Um, so I was messing with textures, things like that. Here's the monkey face. There's some grass over there, and the grass also moves. Um, there's some palm trees over here. Just added those in. Let's see, let's try to go on this ramp. Let's, uh... Okay, I'm not going fast enough, but... If you're going fast enough, you can make it... You can make it onto the bridge. Let's try this one more time. Let's see, am I going the wrong way? Probably. Nope. Okay, and then this speed bump here really makes... <laughs> Really messes with your car. Pressing R. Default controls are down in the bottom left that came with this uh, project. Let's see. Let's try to jump this uh, ramp. Alright, let's try this. When you gain speed, it's a little bit harder to control. Not that bad though. Ah! Okay, and right now I'm I'm <laughs> driving on the wall, sort of. So yeah, that that's kind of what we're working with right here. Uh, nothing crazy right now. This is definitely nowhere near what the project's gonna look like when it's coming, you know, later development. But I just wanted to kind of mess with that, kind of just show y'all, maybe inspire y'all to look into using Unity. It's not too bad. Um, I mean, it's not too hard. So um, I may make a little some other videos on unity also later but uh, for now thank you all for watching have a great day